Yep. Winter, winter has arrived. I had no idea it was gonna snow and keep snowing. Nor did I know a train was coming in the middle of my premiere video. Yeah, that that last video of the fire premiering uh, video, I uh, I had to get up and leave. Train just came by my house and I was like, you know, if it's snowing, I'm definitely going over to County O because uh, they don't have the best reputation for making it up that grade when it's wet, full of leaves or even snow, but uh, we'll see. By the looks of it, it had a bunch of product from LP and it wasn't very long, so I don't know. They'll probably make it. What do you think? 45 miles an hour. Just entered Marinette County. I think you can see the difference on the roads. Lucky for me, I have brand new snow tires on this car. So far, it's uh, holding to the road pretty well. And I'm glad I made it past this crossing because I really want to go to the other one. Oh, there's a camper way up there slowing us down. That's what it is. Never mind the broken pole. There's nothing wrong with it. It's not broke. It's still there. Oh, they're coming across County N right now. Anyway, I just passed, just passed a salt truck. Just went down that way, and he is dumping salt down the road, which is a good thing because uh, a little hairy going right here. Let me see. Let me scrape your feet around. That's your riding surface. Oh, yeah, a little bit slick, a little bit slick. Anyway, should be pretty cool. Train coming this way. Hopefully they'll make it up the hill. They don't have to back up and uh, hit it again. But we'll find out. I see them. Make it. Getting slower.
better get all the way to this huge plow right here. I'll put the camera on in a minute. Town of Niagara. And you got a Fred. We'll stay here for a minute. I mean, they sh should be able to make it now. Back to where I was filming from last night, but we're going over here to do an aftermath video. I'd say it took them about two hours to put it out last night, and then they brought out a backhoe and started pulling things out. So we're gonna walk over here and see. Oh man, you guys see that? Looks like an old Chevy. I don't know if we can we'll walk in here. There is no uh, tape up or anything, so. Yikes. Well, it, that probably was a nice car. No telling what was in the garage. Note the ladder right here to my left. He saved that, remember? Whole fence here is gone. Yeah. I wonder why it caught fire and got as bad as it did. That's sad, you know. He's got some nice stuff back here. Wagon wheel over there. It's like worth a hundred bucks. I can only imagine what was probably back here and worth money that's no longer worth anything. Anyway, you guys wanted an aftermath video. I do not have enough stream out here to actually push a live stream, so this is the best I can do. And cars back in the house. I'm surprised that truck survived. There's another car in the next to the house back there. And yeah, the snow definitely adds something to it, huh? But here's that ladder that he ran back to save. I think that was pretty stupid. Look at the old car here. Not much of not much of a car anymore, is it? What year? 56, 57? Well, I won't ask you to hit that thumbs up button because I don't know how you do. I guess you could hit the thumbs up for the train video before this, but uh, there is the aftermath of the fire last night. If you haven't seen the fire, go back and watch it. I do have video of the explosion from my front house, and I do have video footage from the fire itself pretty intense it smells horrible i'm going home